What did you say? Kill it with... Kill everything. Kill it with fire, okay? Kill it with fire. It's okay. all gone. This is trash. You're better than this. Yo, you deserve better. You deserve better than these futons. <laughs> so, could you tell the viewers what we're doing today? Okay. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the English Vera Kaminka Life channel. So, today, we're getting rid of all the trash. There's no more excuses. I'm here. I'm gonna get shit done. And we're gonna start by just getting the shit out of here. So that's what we're doing today. And the next step, we're still a little bit undecided, but probably just clean one room out, clean the stuff we're gonna keep, put the stuff in the clean room, move on to the next room, clean it out, move on to the next room, clean it out. And then eventually we'll be able to actually take off our shoes at the Genkan. Oh, that sounds great. <laughs> Arigato gozaimasu! Yosh! So what is... What room are we pulling stuff from right now? So, right now we're pulling both from this room and we're going to take the Angawa. It's just... We want to get rid of all of the fabrics because these fabric have accumulated a lot of nasty stuff over the years. You can't tell, but these really stink. It's yes. not a nice, nice <laughs> smell at all. No sorry. So we're getting rid of this. Mm. So there are probably bugs, and probably bug eggs in these fabrics, and we want them gone before spring comes and they wake up. Gotcha. Does this plastic need to come out? Or was it your paper under there? Oh, cloth. Oh, that's a cloth. Get out of here. Yummy. Whoa, several layers of yeah. some kind of, kind of cloth. Yep. Okay. So we got right. a lot of... Wow, so much junk. Old, unfortunately, very nasty jumps. Oh, yeah, the bugs have had... There's even rust on this one. Ew! Oh, Ew. yummy. Uh, I don't have my gloves on. Yuck. Yeah. Okay. I think these are glue sticks. Oh, candles no, probably. Candles. Yeah. There's a lot of incense and candles around here yeah. for the Utsudan. Yeah, for, these are probably good to save if you want to save the uh, Utsudan. But when I see those candles, I think of the, the heaters that, that they make on the DIY videos. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Take like a, a pot and then you have some like heated, heated candles underneath of it. Yeah. I did that once uh, last year when the power cri crisis in Europe went up like mad. Mm. So. <laughs> hey, what works? <laughs> yeah. I mean, like the good thing is that my Swedish house is so well insulated mm. that as long as I put strategically placed, uh, he you know, those heating lights. Um, around the house, it actually warmed it up quite nicely. Mm. So I saved a lot of money on that. Okay. So, uh, now, after we we dump this out, oh, it's almost completely empty. Yeah. Uh, are we going for the boxes yeah. on the outside? So what? So what you what you might not see now is like around the house, like here and around to there, is an angawa, and the angawa is full of trash. So we're going to take out all of the trash so the Angawa is empty. Then we're going to clean the Angawa. And then we're going to clean things, put them in the Angawa, and then clean the next thing, put the other things in there until all the stuff we're going to keep, it's clean and it's in the Angawa. So it's out of the way. Like these heavy furnitures, they're going to have to wait. We can still clean them off. And we can still like try to do our best with this situation here. But if you or someone you know is big and strong, you're welcome to come help move these so that we can <laughs> clean out this area completely and then put these back where we feel like they should be in a more orderly right uh, fashion. Yeah, this one here is large but not yeah. too heavy. Yeah, but but the, but that dresser over there that one over there yeah. and the one behind me. Yes. Um, this one over here yeah. and that one. These are all very heavy. I can't move those by myself. Yeah, and uh, I mean, I'm pretty strong for a gal, but not that strong. So, yeah. Um, step one, just get the trash out. Because all 
all this trash just makes it so hard to move on because you, you just get fatigued just looking at this. Yeah, and you're right. It collects more dust, so it's harder to even try to keep things clean. I mean, you already did some cleaning, and it's already already dusty. Yeah, when when this room was first <laughs> opened, you couldn't even step one foot inside. It was completely full of stuff. Yeah. Exactly. So uh, you can see that I piled up all of yeah. the, the futons and all the, the mm -hmm. fabrics right in the middle to just kind of get them out of the way. Yeah, exactly. So this is all trash. So, it's just going to get out. Yep. Well, it's, maybe, uh, is this trash too? This looks really pretty. Uh, the, the, the little uh, shamisen, yeah. is, it's probably something I'm going to keep. It's yeah. just a cute little toy. Yeah. Just gonna uh, keep this this is trash, obviously. Yeah, but that yeah. That one is too cute to go. Yeah. Yeah, it's just a, it's, I wish I found a real, real one, you know, like yeah. a full-size shaman. So that'd be awesome. That but, would be awesome. But yeah, this is uh, just Basically, a little. you still could, but. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Like, are you going to keep this fan? You need a bigger fan. If, if there are fans that are cool that I could put together, maybe in a frame and hang on the walls decor. Because sometimes I think about that. Is this good decor? Is it something I want to keep and, and put up somewhere? Because the house, once the house is nice, it's going to need decor. Yeah, I like them. Yeah. Yeah, those are nice. Yeah. Maybe that's why they're yeah. kept in paper. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, it's like... Yeah, some of the... That's why I don't just, like, have the burn everything mentality. Because I, I'm thinking about the future. Like, yeah. after the house is clean and ready for people yeah. to come in, I need decor. Yeah. And I don't want to go buying stuff. I'd rather just use stuff that was in the house. I can exactly. tell people, yeah. this was part of the house. This, yeah. this was original. I mean, like... Like, these kinds of things uh, are not trash. Trash? <laughs> not trash. <laughs> They're getting rid of the trash. Not the not trash. There's even, like, the maybe things. Like, oh, I could have use of this. But then you get to think, like, when we get to the point where you actually start to imagine how you're going to furnish and how you're going to do things. Yeah. Then you're going to be like, you know, like, let's say you want to keep that shelf. It's like, oh, it's so handy to keep a shelf. And then when you actually think about it, it's like, there's just shoji doors. Where am I going to put yeah. the shelf? Right. You know? <laughs> so, <laughs> gotta go. Yeah, it doesn't belong here. Yeah. And if it's not nice enough to sell, then it's trash. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. But it could be a maybe for now, because like, oh, I have this furniture, and it's perfectly good. Yeah. It's a little bit dusty. Yeah, and I actually have a couple of bookshelves that I brought with me from my yeah. apartment that I'm using yeah. right now, but later on, they just aren't going to fit into the scheme of the house. Yeah, exactly. So now, usable, later, trash. Yeah, exactly. So, so like, maybes are fine. So it's like, not trash. Oh, horribly bug-infested, nasty cloths. I mean, it's like, to the previous owners and the family of the people who own this place, like, it's not because your family members own this. It's just that these are fabrics that have been sitting here for 25 years. It's, so it's no, dis no disrespect to the people who once used these. Because I mean... Well, the, the other thing is, like they said, when I, yeah. when I bought the house, they said, this stuff is yours. Yeah. If they really wanted it, they would have come back, you know? Exactly. But it's still like, I mean, you don't want to be rude about what you say about their stuff. So, like... I mean, it's no offense to people who used to use them. That's not why they are dirty. They're dirty because they've been sitting there for 25 years. So right. I'm not trying to be... <laughs> These dirty people. Oh, jeez, oh, you were so dirty. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not saying that. Right. You can see out here, right? The area that goes around the house. And... This this room right here to the left is the the Butsudan room. It also has the uh, um, the uh, the part of the floor with the uh, uh, kotatsu. I'm sorry, uh, I lost my train of thought there. The kotatsu that's in the ground that you can use coals with. It's in this room here. But as you come down here, you can see there there's a lot of junk. There are some sliding doors that will be kept right. And then there's some more shoji doors right here. And uh, some other... This looks like a fold-out mirror. I think this is pretty nice. Definitely we'll, we'll use that and keep it. But here in the corner, this is where most of all the junk is. Take a look at this. Lots and lots of boxes. 
there are some books, but a lot of this is just junk that needs to be thrown out and burned. Look at these old curtains, you know, garbage, just junk. Uh, there used to be a lot of these curtains in the house, but I've torn, torn down all of them except for just this one section. The uh, boxes and all of these things down here, they kind of use this as a catch-all area where they were just tossing boxes. So 90% of these boxes are empty. And there are a few tables, like the kotatsu tables, and some frames that aren't used. So we're just going to be tossing this stuff out and clearing it. And there we go. So um, this is where I'm going to stop filming for now and get back to going outside and tossing stuff on the fire.